Tonight, there is backlash in Apache Junction after the district's governing board gave a popular school superintendent her walking papers. This week, the board voted to cut ties with a very well-liked superintendent, Heather Wallace, and now parents are rallying to launch a recall petition against the two board members who voted her out. Team 12's Joe Dana live for us tonight in Apache Junction with the surprising new developments. Joe? The local Republican Party here helped get three board members elected who are at the center of this controversy. Now, across the country, we have seen a strain of the Republican Party get involved in school boards, in the politics of school boards. And here, a group of parents and teachers say they have simply gone too far, now planning a recall effort against board members Gail Concho and Dina Kimball. That third member, Gail Ross, has not served long enough to qualify for the recall. Critics argue, though, these three forced out the very popular superintendent, Heather Wallace, and that they plan to put someone in place who will strip the district of important social and emotional learning tools, along with other aspects. Community members, they packed the House this week to discuss the recall campaign. Uh, if they gather enough signatures for this, this would be the first major pushback against what some view as uh, party politicization of schools here in the Valley. People are upset. They really are. This is where they don't even want any emotional well-being in the kids. They're wanting to go back to, to the 70s. And it doesn't make sense now, and everyone knows it. We're working to get response from the board members being targeted. Also, the state superintendent, Tom Horn, weighed in on this to give you an idea of sort of the larger impact this is having here in the state. We're going to have more on all of this coming up at 10 o'clock. In Apache Junction, Joe Dana, 12 News. All right, Joe, we'll see you then. Thank you.